As the days separating now and November 5th begin to lessen, more and more signs of various political candidates begin to appear in abundance. But over this past weekend, the Dover Foxcroft Police Department says they received several complaints regarding the removal of political signs from public easements, specifically along West Main Street and Park Street. In a post on the department's Facebook page, it says, quote, It was requested that no action be taken, but we are asked to remind folks that tampering with or removal of political signs from any public way or private property is a violation of main law. That main law is in reference to unlawful removal of temporary signs. Unless a person is authorized to remove signs placed within a public right of way, the main legislature says a person who takes, defaces, or disturbs a sign placed within the public right of way is committing a civil violation. Those found guilty of committing said violation may be adjudged a fine of up to $250. Angel Braggin, a Dover Foxcroft resident and owner of the store and more, says over this past weekend she placed a total of six political signs that support former President Donald Trump out on the public easement in front of the Piscataquis County Democrats building on West Main Street. By Monday, those signs were removed, and Braggin says she found them placed behind the building. We reached out to the Piscataquis County Democrats, but did not receive a response. How much is a sign going to sway somebody? So we all put them out, and it's for a short time. What's the point in not being tolerant? In Dover Foxcroft, Doug Banks, ABC7 and Fox 22 News.